Well, this is probably what a lot of us are waiting for, the AMD Ryzen 9 9950X 3D. Let's go through this. This is very exciting. However, uh, this has been spotted and apparently tested. I don't know how true any of this information is, so take all of this with lots of grains of salt. So the AMD Ryzen 9 9950X 3D is an upcoming high performance processor that promises to push the boundaries of gaming and content creation with 16 cores, 32 threads, and a massive 128 megabytes of 3D V cache, and that cache is stacked a little bit differently on this chip, so you get better thermals, that means you can overclock it. This CPU is expected to deliver exceptional performance in all kinds of demanding workflows. Now, I can't even imagine the cost on this. Here in Canada, this processor is going to be well beyond $1,000. And I suspect probably the 9800X 3D, which is a Ryzen 7 CPU, is going to be close on $1,000. But if you want the very, very best, wait for the 9950X 3D. This one, because of course, this one will outperform the 9800X 3D, but how much power do you need? Well, of course, you need the maximum amount of power. That's not always true, though. You want to go for what you think is the best bang for the buck overall. Okay, so let's jump back into this processor, the Ryzen 9 9950X 3D, and talk some more about it. So I want to just say this again, because it's crazy, right? You've got 16 cores, 32 threads on this processor. That, again, is going to give you massive amounts of power for gaming, multitasking, all kinds of crazy workloads and the 3d v cache is 128 megabytes and this is going to improve performance even more especially in games and there's going to be a higher clock speed for this one and you're going to be able to overclock it as well now i saw red heard maybe somewhere about this particular processor being overclocked almost close on seven gigahertz so I don't know, like, you know, I mean, a lot of this stuff is all rumors and speculation, right? So keep that in mind. But if that's the case, I can't even imagine. This is going to be, this is going to destroy Intel, really, uh, especially when it comes to gaming. And if all of that wasn't enough, it has amazing power efficiency. Second gen 3D vCache technology is expected to improve power efficiency so all good news here amd is literally killing it when it comes to the cpu side of things not the video cards and i wish i wish they would put maybe more time and effort into that because i think i think they could compete with nvidia if they really put their mind to it and who knows maybe they will they said they won't but they might, and I really hope that is the case. Now, it might seem as if I'm very excited about this processor. Well, you would be absolutely correct, and I suspect if you're watching this video and you've made it this far, you are also very, very excited about the release of this processor, and I hope it's released sooner than later. I mean, 64% faster than the 7950X 3D? That is substantial. All right, well, I'm going to end this video with something that I don't normally say anymore, and that's about subscribing, liking, sharing, and in any way promoting my content. If you're watching this and you like it, this stuff keeps me motivated and keeps me going and keeps me producing these videos. And we all need a little bit of, oh, oh, sometimes.